Buongiorno, welcome to Langa Property. Today I want to explain something to you that's a little bit special. An incredible historic home in a significant town in the center of Piedmont, Italy. The house was built in the 1700s but feels pristine. The property has been in the owner's family for generations and was once the home of nobles. And the price is irresistible. Have you heard of Luigi Tenco? Probably not, but if I ask that question to an Italian, they'll say yes, because Luigi was a very famous 1960s singer, songwriter and actor. And he was from the town and grew up where this house is located. Like many celebrities, he burned very brightly, but only very briefly, and he died in 1967. But he left a permanent mark on music and cinema in Italy. You could perhaps compare him to James Dean. Now, the owner of the house, he grew up with Luigi and he told me some stories about him. For example, he said that when the lads in the town were playing football or soccer, if you're in America, the, that Luigi would, would watch, but he didn't really want to play. It sounds a bit like me, but I'm still waiting for the call from Hollywood. But I'm alive and I'm very happy to be here in Italy and to present this house to you. Now what I'm going to do is take you to my studio and I'll show you some pictures and explain more about the property from there. But let me finish up here and I'll be right with you. Let's start in this incredible courtyard. I can honestly say that once you're inside, the outside world disappears. It's silent and totally private. The house is big, around 980 square meters or 10,000 square foot. The courtyard is around 1,300 square meters or 14,000 square foot. And it's possible to park in there, but outside there's parking, there's no problem. It's a very peaceful area. Now look at these arches. I counted the bricks and there are, no, okay. I didn't count them, but as you can see, the work that went into building this is extraordinary and it's just in amazing condition. The owner is very particular, a noble person that also cares about the aesthetics and I promise you that can be something hard to find. Now this is the entrance, there are actually two entrances and it's possible to park in here as I've already said and there's also no problem putting in a swimming pool. The owners have considered doing this and looked into it. You would need to apply for permission but it should be possible. At the far end, you have these two beautiful storerooms. You can fit in a couple of Ferraris and Lamborghinis in there, no problem at all. Here's the plan for the courtyard. You can see there's also an office and a bathroom. Enjoy the details for a moment. And here are some photographs from the top floor overlooking the courtyard so you get an idea of its layout. This is what greets you in the entrance hall. This beautiful staircase and look at the exquisite ceilings as well. Let's go up to the first floor. Here's the plan for what we'll call the villa. You come into this incredible lounge and again, look at that amazing ceiling and look down as well at the floor. It's just exquisite, beautiful hardwood floors and these mosaics in the ceilings that have been painted with great care and are in perfect condition. Next to this is the kitchen. The units have been removed, but uh, there's all the things there you need to install a new one. And there's also another kitchen on this floor as well. Then we have the beautiful bedrooms and the bathrooms. There are a total of seven rooms and two bathrooms. At the moment, four rooms are used as bedrooms. Now above this floor are the servants' quarters, I kid you not. It needs some TLC, but it could be a great living space. There are four bedrooms, a kitchen and a bathroom. Here's the plan. 
And here we have some photographs as well. Now, if you thought the courtyard is incredible, look at what's underneath the house, this amazing cellar. You can use this, of course, for storing your wine or for food or turn it into a dining room. One of our friends has converted their house and it has this beautiful big table and we love to have meals there and drink fine wines in this beautiful space with good lighting and nice antique furniture. It can be a really, really special place. I see a lot of houses and I've seen hundreds of houses in the last 20 years working in real estate here in Piemonte and I swear that by far this is one of my favourites and it's just a really outstanding house and being offered for relatively not so much money considering what you get the style and the condition of the property. This is another one of those houses that within five years, everyone will want for the price it is being sold for now, but it will be impossible. You have to move now or lose it and maybe regret it. Call me, email me, get over here and we'll set up a viewing with the agent, but bring your checkbook because when you see it, I'm certain that you'll want it. Thank you so much for watching. Click the like and subscribe, and that can really help me to produce more content that you can view and find more great houses. We're hoping for good weather back soon so we can get out and start filming to bring you more great houses. Thanks again, look forward to seeing you soon.